The following video is designed to help give you some basic techniques on how to install Haldex ABS wheel speed sensors. The components used when installing an ABS sensor are the ABS sensor, the bushing clip, clips, and the sensor block. Wheel speed sensors are most commonly routed with the air hoses. That's why Haldex does not recommend the use of tie straps. The recommended practice is to use the following clips that will protect the sensor wire and won't restrict the flow of air passing through the air hose. This clip also lets the air hose expand and release as air is passing through. We want to avoid putting any stress on the sensor wire that could potentially damage the internal wiring and restriction of airflow passing through the air hose. This is common when a tie strap is pulled too tightly around the air hose and the ABS sensor. To install the clips, line up the sensor wire or extension cable to the air hose, then press down the clip on the air hose, making sure that the sensor wires line up in the groove of the clip and that the clip is securely seated on the air hose. You want to make sure to put each clip about 12 inches apart from one another. Any excess wire or cable should get bundled up in a bow tie or dog bone. You want to avoid looping any extra slack as it can get damaged by debris on the road or cause interference to the ABS signal. When you make your ABS sensor connection to the extension cable or ABS sensor to the ECU, it's always a good practice to use dielectric grease to protect the connections, then make your connections. Haldex sensor cables come with a yellow cover clip to help protect the ABS sensor to the extension cable connections. Be sure to install the clip after making your connections. Each sensor comes with a bushing clip. Prior to installing the clip into the ABS sensor block, a lubricant should be applied to prevent corrosion. Install the bushing clip all the way into the sensor block until it is properly seated. Next, install the sensor into the bushing clip that was just pressed into the sensor block. Again, a lubricant should be applied to the sensor to help prevent any corrosion that could damage it. Now go ahead and install the ABS sensor into the sensor block. Make sure that when you install the sensor, you push it all the way in until it makes contact with the ABS tooth wheel. The ABS wheel speed sensor will set itself and there's no need to gap the sensor. For more information, visit Haldex.com.